now i am talking about the barcode generation here you can go to main desktop of shopper then you can click on stock here it will show there is few option called so many things import physical verification goods inwards goods inwards wise goods outward pt file information stock shifting stock pack, packing and barcode and purchase order here we need we have an intention we need to create the, sorry we need to generate the barcode labels so you can click on the barcode then again it will show four option design label for the barcode printer design label for the standard printer design label for standard printer layout for the standard printer and print labels here you can just go select directly print labels it will show the option tag printing here again it will ask the script file name so depends on the design we made it already in the uh, shopper so we can just select it here what is the script name we need to select we can select this is the script name we already configured in the our system here you can just select which stock number you need to print for example i'm using the search option called f2 you can just press f2 what is the product i need to create the generate i need to generate the barcode labels for example product name is sukradar i can mention type it here in the description column so here you can see mrp is 135 and quantity is 208 it is there but i wanted to take sticker one barcode label only for 100 quantity here so you can select the product name so this is the stock number it will show so cva 00384 is the stock number i wanted to take only for 100 labels and then you can give okay here so it will ask some question, uh, details edit quantity details here the stock number is showing cva 00384 product name is medicine brand name is elder and it's asking lbls in the sense how many labels do you need to print for example i'm putting 100 labels here then you can put an 100 then you can give okay it will start printing it for example if you want to take at a time pro two product it should be number should be always continuous if otherwise it will not able to take the print out for at a time or one more option is then for example you wanted to take the barcode labels against transaction for example i wanted to print all the barcodes here so then we have to put the what is the purchase document free x fix 716 is the option document number then you can view okay so it will show what is the product then you can print it that is the one option you have to do the against transaction but normally we are using manual selection only that you can follow it